and just Jackie is here. Listen, long time no hear from y'all. Ain't heard that in a minute, right? Hey, beautifuls, I'm just Jackie is here. Yeah, no, long time, y'all, long time. So I'm here, and um, you know, I'm gonna do like a not a get ready with me. Listen, I'm just gonna do a quick simple face of the day, and I'm gonna talk about my hair. Okay, I'm gonna talk about my hair. Y'all see something different with my hair? Do y'all see the difference? Yeah. So ironically, today is August the 18th and my seven year back to natural anniversary was on the 14th. So I said, why? Yeah. Listen, y'all, I ain't got time to give y'all all the background. I'll give y'all bits and pieces and stuff, you know, as we pro progress down YouTube land. But um, hold up, y'all. Hold the phone. Listen. So, yeah. Y'all see I'm sitting, you know, I got the patio behind me and stuff. But anyway, um, yeah, like I was saying, I'm just going to do a quick face. But let, I already primed my face. Let me prime these beautiful lips. Okay. These beautiful lips. I love this. I don't even know what to call it. A lip balm. Whatever. This is called Melan Goats or whatever. My light, my lighting is so bright up in here, but hopefully y'all can see it pretty good. Well, anywho, y'all know I'm rusty, but anyway, this stuff good. All right, so um, I ain't even gonna tell you the where I, where I've been or what. Y'all know where I've been. Y'all know where I've been. Y'all know what I've been doing. But anyway, like I said, I already primed my face, so I'm gonna take some LA Girl Pro Concealer. And I'm gonna hit the little spots that I ain't happy with. Y'all saw I had a little little breakout, whatever, whatever. So and then I'm gonna get under my under eyes a little bit. Then I don't have no really bad dark circles or anything, but I'm gonna get it, you know. At one time I was hitting a little forehead, but those little imperfections are starting to fade out. I ain't gonna lie, y'all. Sister girl was been a little stressed or whatever, whatever. But um Making ways, making changes, or whatever. But um, yeah. So then I'm gonna take the color correct because I feel like I got a little beard, like right here. I'm gonna call it a goatee. We're gonna call it. I feel like I got a goatee, not really a mustache, but right here. So I do the color correct then, just to even the skin out before I apply whatever foundation or whatever I'm doing. So anyway, y'all. So today. Like I said, it's Sunday. I'm not going to beat the face for y'all. I'll come back another time and um beat the face for my beautifuls. But I figure why not come back, show y'all my quick face that I've been doing for work. You know, so I'm going to show y'all my work face, right? Because I don't really do a whole lot no more like I used to. I feel like less is more. So I've just been going with a more natural, natural look face. You know what I'm saying? So I have really been getting into color correcting because I am a woman of age and obviously I'm aging. <laughs> okay. We all aging. So I didn't used to have um too much of a, I, I never really got into color correcting, but as I'm getting older and more experienced with my face, I guess I should say, I just realized I need color correcting. So see how simple, like see how even look. Listen, I mean, you can still see the little two little blemishes I have right there, but I don't cover it up to, like, hide everything. I just cover it up so it won't be so noticeable or whatever. However, I'm trying to say, I still want to have a natural look when I'm done at the end of the day, okay? So, LA Girl Pro Concealers, shout out to y'all. I love it, okay? Um, y'all. Oh, damn it. I'm so pissed. Hold on, y'all. Because it hit my camera. And I'm not editing. I'm not editing nothing. Y'all hear all that stuff falling in the background? I'm not editing nothing. All right. There we go. All right. So, anywho, y'all. Let me get these brows popping. So, so what have I been up to lately? Been focusing on the career move, career change. I was trying to do a locality change, but that didn't work out how I wanted 
I swear if this camera keeps slipping, I'm going to fight. We fighting. We fighting. And who I'm fighting, y'all? The camera. So, look, look. I ain't, listen. But anyway, locality change, whatever, whatever, whatever. But that ain't what we're going to focus on right now. We're going to focus on what I said in the beginning. We celebrated my seven-year um, natural hair anniversary. And I'm still natural after seven years. And as y'all can see, I'm going through another transition with this natural hair. I decided to go the lock route because, listen, for real, for real, before I went on my big YouTube hiatus, y'all know I was on a um, protect the styling uh, journey or whatever. Listen, I was not expecting that journey to last that long. That journey lasted a long ass time. It was about two years, wasn't it? I mean, if y'all keeping up on keeping up with me on Instagram, like I keep telling y'all, y'all would have seen all the wigs I was kept rocking, all the um, and then I eventually I I faded away from wigs and I was really doing the um crochet styles. So I was doing a whole lot of a whole lot of a whole lot. Okay. I don't even know why I'm giving y'all these brows today. It is Sunday, but it's, this is YouTube. I'm giving y'all a video. I said I'm going to give y'all my simple work face because that's what I said I'm going to do. So anyway, simple work face. And these y'all know this is what I do with my brows. Listen, I would love to get the micro, whatever you call it, but mm-mm. I mean, a part of me likes doing this shit with my brows. Don't ask me why, but I'm just weird. All right, y'all, this is all I'm giving y'all with these brows today because I keep telling y'all it's Sunday. So, anyway, um, but, yeah, so I decided to go the lock route. And I, the only thing I regret is why didn't I do the lock thing sooner? I don't know. But, you know, a friend of mine was like, um, you ever thought about locks or just chopping your hair off again? Y'all know I was good for a big chop. Y'all know I was a bald headed baddie, a bad ass bald headed baddie back in the day. <laughs> right? So I was like, I contemplated it. I didn't want to do the big chop again because I had already said after that last big chop, I was going to let my hair grow out and I didn't want to cut my hair no more. So I was like, huh. And I, you know what? The main reason why I didn't get locks is because I thought I couldn't get versatility and styling. Boy, was I wrong. You know, I was doing my research and I seen how how the girls are rocking their different lock styles. And, and like, I know girls, with, I know the, the queens with locks, like Aria in New York. I mean, she be killing it all the time. All the time she be killing the style. So I don't know what I was thinking. And then ironically, I was like, you know, I got my YouTube video. I be doing my wig reviews. But, hell, I can still do wig reviews too, y'all. Because, um... Bitch, I can get locks up under wigs. Did y'all? Hello. I can get locks up under the wig. So, beautiful. Trust me. You're going to get a wig review very, very soon. Like I said, if you keep up with me on Instagram, you will see the picture I posted of that wig I had on. So, y'all be ready for that because that is definitely coming. So, anyway. I started my lock journey in February, February 9th or 2nd, somewhere around there to be exact. But, um, yeah, and the funny part is, like, when I first showed my little coils off, or what do you want to call it? I went with the comb coil method, y'all, comb coil. That's the method I went with, okay? So, comb coil. So, yeah, I had a couple of, um, a couple of sisters that, who are already, um, obviously already 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 um already locked they asked me how many did i start with i was like i didn't know what to tell them because i i honestly i didn't know but you know what i did i took the time to count each and every one of them before i came and did this video right so i have 122 122 is up on this head right okay so that's what's popping on his head. So for anybody who wants to know, it's 122. Y'all, I'm going to keep fixing this camera because it's pissing me off. <laughs> so anyway, all right. So back to what I was saying. So all right. Y'all see I had the concealer or whatever. I'm just going to finish off this concealer with my Estee Lauder Double Wear. All right. That's what I normally do. 
Again, I'm giving y'all work face. So I'm going to take this bad girl right here. And I'm going to use the brown that's in there. Okay. Now, y'all, I have been... I ain't been buying no makeup for real. And, and that is not because I'm on a makeup no buy. I'm not. I just really haven't been into anything lately. So I've been lazy with makeup. <laughs> Hell. And this is how I came up with this quick, simple, everyday work face. Because y'all know I used to get up in the morning and beat this face and go off the world like a happy little girl. <sighs> y'all, them days are gone. <laughs> Them days are gone. Now, I'm still going to give you a face, but it ain't going to be beat. I need to say the beat face is for huh, occasions that deserve a beat face. How about that? I don't know. But, y'all, I'm just dusting this color on my eyes. Some of y'all ain't doing much. Try to keep that little natural look. It's a piece of hair or something, a fiber in my eye. Okay. So, yeah, I took this little, what's it called? Chocolate truffle. Took the chocolate truffle right there, and we're going to keep it moving, right? All right. So, now I'm going to take the one of my, I think it's Anastasia Beverly Hills, but anyway, it's this color. Anastasia Beverly Hills, red something. Don't ask me. I don't know no colors. I don't know nothing. And, yes, I'm using the same brush. I told you. Keeping it simple. Add a little bit more color to it. Add some warmth. See how I'm warming my eyes up a little bit. Oh, I forgot to do one one thing. Well, I forget. I can go back to it. Well, it really don't matter. It just depends. So, oh, and I forgot to tell you guys what I primed my face with. I primed my face with a, with a new primer. I got a sample from Sephora. It is. It is, y'all. Where is it at? It is called Illusion Primer. It's from Urban Decay Optical. See? It's like a lotion, y'all. It's really like a lotion. I don't know if I can get that. The only thing about this, I don't... The lights are damn bright. Here we go. It's like a lotion. You know what I'm saying? So... I got that on my face. I want to test this thing out all week, y'all. And I'll come back at the end of the week and let y'all know how I'm feeling about that primer. So that's the primer I got on my face. So anyway, y'all already saw me do the concealer and the color correcting. I'm just going to like finish it off. Kind of like set it. Just set it with this all. Makeup forever. Makeup Forever, um, I don't even know what it's called, this loose one, this loose matte powder from Makeup Forever, okay, alright, let's keep it going, let's keep it moving, alright, so, to finish off the eyes, and y'all said finish off the eyes, yes, to finish off the eyes, girls, because I, I told you I ain't doing a whole lot with this stuff, I'm going to take the, this other Anastasia Beverly Hill color, I don't know what it is, but I'm just going to hit it right here in the corner, just to give it the illusion of some depth. <laughs> but not really. Listen. And the cool thing about my little simple looks. Y'all, anybody can do this look, y'all. I ain't coming up here with a thousand products. And y'all got to write down a long ass list of products to get a look from one of our fave YouTubers. And then you buy all that shit. And you still don't get that look like them? Nah. I guarantee y'all get this look like Jackie. Because this was simple. Super simple. And y'all ain't even got to get the same products I get. Just look at the colors I'm using. And look at eyeshadows you already have in a palette. Or whatever. And y'all can use it. And get the same simple natural looking eyes that Jackie has. Okay. I'm um, wearing for a word. Right. Alright y'all. So... Jackie ain't doing no liquid foundation. I ain't, I ain't doing it, y'all. I just ain't doing no liquid foundation. So, this is what Jackie gonna do. Jackie gonna... Let me find my brush. Jackie gonna contour. 
Shit, if I can find my contour brush. Hmm. See how you get that? Everything's supposed to be right here. Y'all see my little brushes? Everything's supposed to be right here. And I know it's in here. It's just hiding from me. Probably ain't really a contour brush, but it's a contour brush I'm going to use. So I'm just going to dip up in here. Y'all already see what I'm using. Y'all already see. Y'all see it. So anyway. And you're like, Jackie, you ain't on. No, Jackie, no, I didn't. No, no foundation. Just wait for it. Just wait for it, y'all. Just wait for the nonsense that I'm about to give y'all. Okay. Come up in here. Everything gonna blend out for life. I told you I'm being super lazy. Super lazy. Super lazy. Taking the sculpt in the center. Yes, same brush, y'all. I told you. Super lazy. Super duper lazy. Super duper lazy. Back to the actual, yeah. And I'm just going. Right here. But yeah, back to these baby locks, y'all. So, like I was saying, it was either the big chop again. I'm sorry, y'all. I don't know why my nose is up in here running. It's either the big chop again or let's try these locks. So, I done big chop three times out of the last seven years I've been natural. You know what I'm saying? So, I ain't want to do it again. Okay? I ain't want to do it again. Just taking the scope. Just taking the scope, y'all. All right. So, anywho. So, with all that being said, I'm going to... Let me take my take this again I really haven't been wearing eyeliner you guys I've just been taking the black in this um chocolate gold or in my smoky palette and I've been going like so and that's it that's all I've been doing told you I've been lazy y'all so if y'all was wondering why Jackie decided to grow locks, there you go. I just, I never tried it. And, oh, when I did wear my, and I still had started wearing my natural hair out again. I stopped with the, um, what do you call it, with the protective style and with the wigs and the crochets. And I was literally wearing my natural hair out. But here's the kicker. The only thing I was, I just would wear it up in a puff. Like, Listen. I'm like, what in the world? You ain't doing nothing with your hair, girl. So, I was like, okay. Let me go ahead and try these locks since I was not doing nothing. Nothing but putting my natural hair up in the puff. I miss my puff, though. But that's all right. I'm going to give you something with these locks popping. All right. So, on and forward, I do want to do a, a slight under eye highlight. Y'all, telling you, I can. All right. A slight under eye highlight. It's going to be real slight. All right, so this is a 24-hour Studio Fix um, Smooth Wear Concealer from MAC. Okay, this is probably the most recent thing I have purchased. And I'm just going to keep it simple. I'm not going to go crazy. I'm not going to go crazy. I'm keeping it real simple. And y'all going to see how lazy Jackie has been for real. Okay. You're like, you said simple, but you're putting it on. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. It's the... Here's the illusion of looking like I did something with this face, okay? So, now, we're going to blend all this in. And, uh, but, yeah. I'm just, I, you know what? I know I have not been consistent on my channel for the last, probably, yeah, I'm going to go with the last two years, right? I ain't want to come all the way down there, but it is what it is now. Watch this. We just gonna get it all together. Alright, so yeah, for the last two years, but anybody who knows me, y'all pay attention to my life after 40 series and all that stuff. <sighs> you pretty much know why I went on my YouTube hiatus. But I know everybody was like, well, damn, Jackie's podcasting and shit, but she ain't doing on YouTube. It you know what? It was different. Like I was telling 
a few people. The podcasting was different because people, other people was actually dependent on me. So I couldn't flick out. You know, I couldn't flick out on the podcast and when you have a partner who's relying on you to be there to record. I had no accountability in the YouTube world. So it was easier for me to fall back from YouTube and just attach myself to Y'all, podcasting. I don't know where did that damn but video has been stopped at. Like I said, but bitch, two years I'm here. Of inconsistency. I'm back. I'm still and giving y'all this two years of saying simple ass somewhere face. in between. I'm coming back. I'm kind of pissed. And I never I'll came be back. Cutting and editing. Y'all, this shit. is a quick. Okay. But anyway, quick fix. Like I so, said, ignore um, me rushing and shit. But I'm here. I don't know what to okay. say. I'm kind of pissed because it, it wasn't so recording. So anyway, um, it stopped recording for some reason. So anyway, um, but yeah, um, again, I don't know where the other video left just, off, but we here, and I'm gonna take my tart, the tart, whatever that new tart, whatever y'all this, and the color I have is deep natural deep neutral or whatever so i'm just gonna take it and do it in the center of my face right it's a foundation y'all this is the i'm just doing powder i'm gonna go right in the center of this face okay then i want to come back with my it did break. This motherfucker. Can you tell? This literally just hit the floor. Y'all probably didn't hear it or see it because it wasn't recorded. Look at that. And I just got all these pieces dumped on me. <sighs> anyway. So I'm just finishing my face off, y'all. I'm so annoyed with this video right now. <laughs> Welcome back to YouTube, bitch. This is what happens. Real life shit, right? I'm just buffing, buffing, buffing. I'm using my BH Cosmetic brushes. I love these BH Cosmetic brushes. Yeah, I'm making sure this shit record. I love my BH Cosmetic brushes. And I'm just blending everything in. Blush, bronzer. Uh, <laughs> I said bronzer. What the fuck? Because y'all know what I'm talking about. Uh, contour, whatever. All this stuff getting blended in. Simple face. I am mad. If y'all can see my pants right now and see all the my skin finish that hit my lap. So after I finish with the eyes and all that stuff, foundation, and it depends on what how I'm feeling that morning. It really depends on how much time I have. If I'm not up, if I'm not up and and ready. At a certain time, just and starting my makeup, I'm just going to do powder. I'm not going to do a liquid foundation. I'm just going to do powder and keep it moving for the day. Plus, it's summertime, people. I don't believe it at that. It's summertime. So, let me do this mascara. This is still Maybelline Lash Sensational, but it's a different... Uh, I forgot what it's called. Lash Sensational... I don't know. Last sensational fan effect or something like that. Um, but anyway, y'all know the other one was the in the black. This one's in like a rose colored um container. And the wand is different. The wand got this curve like so. And I think it's I need to get a refill, y'all. But I think the the curve is perfect because I feel like I can sit it right here on the curve and just come right up like so and I'm good it's just like right there I don't go down and I don't go over and under I just do the under part of my lashes I never got into the over part so one's done one's not so and I didn't prime them y'all know I'm good for priming the lashes with the uh, Urban Decay uh, lash primer but like I said, I just saved that for when I just want to get jazzy, jazzy. So anyway, but see that curve? I'm doing. I'm gonna do it again. See that curve? I'm just sitting the curve right here, and boom. So 
Yeah. Got this video all over the place. I'm kind of pissed because it stopped recording. So anyway, and I don't know where it stopped recording at. Um, but anywho, I'm mad because my back broke too. Look at it didn't break. It it broke enough though. It like you see that? Oh god, it broke enough. Look at that shit falling out. Let me just dump it all out. There you go. Fuck it. So to see how that little divot right there? That's where it shattered. So we do get my life together. And you know what? I don't even care no more. <laughs> I don't care no more. I'm just going to go ahead on and put a highlight on because maybe it'll make me feel better. <laughs> maybe it'll make me feel like I did something with my face. But I really did. I really did, y'all. I'm mad. Because I don't know where the where the camera start recording. <laughs> I'm so pissed. I'm so pissed. But I'm rusty with the YouTube. It's my fault. I'm just rusty. I like to put it up here too, y'all. I sure do. Finish off my little brow brow. With a little highlight up there too. Listen, I'm so pissed. Alright. Come back with the I'm gonna do this one more time. I just want to make sure I blend it out good. That's all I want. That's all I want. Oh. All right, girl. Listen. All right, y'all. So again, I've been keeping a simple, neutral, natural face. So two colors on the eyes. Been dusting my eyes with the all uh, dusting. I've been lining my eyes with the uh. The black eyeshadow from the um, chocolate gold palette or my smoky palette from Urban Decay. Um, so, Minted Cosmetics. I love their. Listen, this is the only one I got. I'm talking about I love their lipsticks. Listen, so far I got one and I love it, right? Own, black owned company, Minted Cosmetics. And this one is called Deep Taupe. Notice I'm not lining my lips. I hit my tooth. I'm not lining my lips. I'm just going to put this on like so. Not lining my lips. Then I come back over top of it with the, <laughs> the NYX Butter Lipstick. And this one's called Pop. Or is it Pops? No, this ain't Pops. Shit. Oh, it is Pops. This one's called Pops. And I just hit it in the center. Alright, so, you know what, I forgot I got a text earlier. Okay, so, I got a couple of texts. Anyway, I got a, so I'll just, see how I'm just doing it in the center, right here? All the way around. Right here, center. And then I'm just going to. Do it like that. I don't know if y'all paying attention. But now I have the illusion that my lips are lined. Because the dope taupe is looking like it's my lip liner. Did y'all catch that? Okay, yeah. So anyway, alright y'all. Little bit more. Listen, I don't need nothing else. I don't need nothing else. I don't need nothing else. Little bit more blush and then we done. Didn't really, don't really need it. Don't really need it. All right. So, one more thing. I'm mad because y'all was like 5 o'clock. I should have did this video earlier, but, you know, time gets away from me. So, all right. Face is done. See how simple that face is? And I know I don't look like I did a million things with the face. I didn't. I, I told y'all I've been lazy. But, eh, this is, look, eh, this is what I'm giving you. Eh, that's all you get. Eh. And then, of course, I talk, I'm telling you about my beautiful lock journey. Like I said, I have 122 of these babies in my head. And, yeah, right now I'll just be doing the part and pushing most of it over here to the side. And I let it rock like this. Let it cook. Let it bake in the oven. And, yeah. And I do need a, re, a refresh twist or whatever. But, yeah, but. My hair, the shrink is just real with the hair, y'all. She's here. She's here. If she, if, if I could stretch her ass out, she would be right there. So, you know, if I could, the bangs. 
if I can stretch her out, they ain't floating around. So, but I know my hair is still a 4C. <laughs> Nothing's changed just because I got lots as a 4C. So, my hair always shrunk terrible the shrinkage was real with the hair you know what i'm saying so and the shrinkage is still real with these locks so yeah but honestly i ain't gonna lie it was tough in the beginning with this lock journey because i just wasn't okay when you first get this stuff done it's not full or no it's just flat it's just flat right y'all know jackie like the big girl the big hair don't care girl I, that's who i am big hair don't care and i i was just like flat and i was like there's no body there's no life blah, blah, blah. so i wasn't feeling it at first and then i was messing with it too much so it wasn't doing what it was supposed to be doing with, within the first couple of months because i was just doing too much with the hair leave the, leave the motherfuckers alone y'all just leave the locks on long let them do what they want to do but i couldn't leave them alone but anyway it took me about two minutes two minutes two months to leave them alone right finally stopped leaving them alone or whatever i just um like in in the process of those two months i was just like forget it i was wearing my natural wigs you know the, the natural textured wigs and blending them with um the locks and everything for you know a hot second or whatever then i finally got comfortable with them i wasn't comfortable with them i just it just there was just nobody it, they hadn't budded yet now i got the budding you see what i'm saying it's the it's budding here and I just, yeah, I, I don't care who don't like this look that I got right now. I like this look. It's nice. I feel it, it's full. It's body. Like, and then I can, if I want to, I can flat twist them at night when they get old. And then when I get up in the morning, I, I take the flat twist out and they got a little bit of body. It got body to it. You know what I'm saying? So when I take them out in the morning, they have a little, and got my hair looking all thick and luscious you know what i mean so anyway it's, it's listen i can't do much with them now but i can't wait to when i get to the point i'm just knocking off this makeup off my pants and stuff <sighs> oh it's a lot um but i can't wait till i get to the point where i can do um you know a little bit more with her but I'm, I'm loving i'm loving she now i'm loving the hair with the locks now um I just wasn't used to it. I just wasn't used to seeing all that limp, limp, lifeless hair. Now, hey, give me body. Get me body. You know what I'm saying? So if anybody's thinking about lock journey or whatever, I, listen, and everybody told me this, so I'm telling them, pay, uh, listen, pay it forward. Have patience. That's all you got. That's all I got. You got to have patience with this lock journey, y'all, because it we see that we see locks on people when they already went through the process that I'm going through, and I'm like, ooh, it's so pretty. Listen, when your joints start locking up, you can be like, mm -mm, I don't like this. Mm -mm, mm -mm. I don't care if you free forming, free falling, whatever, cone coils, what, whatever you're doing, fox locks, whatever you're doing. Yeah, just have patience with it. But anyway, beautifuls, this is this is it. This is all I got. I just wanted to come back and just reintroduce myself, really, because <laughs> I've been gone so i'm here and happy seven year natural anniversary to me yes i'm starting a new journey so it's a lock journey so i don't know how i'm going to chronicle it or, or whatever y'all know how i'm just jackie is i'm very random so we'll see i'm going to come back and let my beautiful know about that primer from um, urban decay see how i'm liking it and yeah simple face this is when i say everyday face at work this is everyday face at work but yeah i was kind of rushing 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 for the video sake but um yeah it's still a face yeah it's cute <laughs> anyway oh, until the, oh, see how rusty i am until the next time beautifuls this is